and add a spacer. So whatever we put over here will be uh, pushed all the way to the side, to the leading part. And also we want to add a vertical stack and another spacer. Spacer, there we go. So we're just going to push everything up. Okay, so uh, let me just put it over here. So now here is the place where we are going to add the side in menu. So side, side, me oh, sorry, side menu view. And we are going to get back an action index. So action index. And according to the action index, we're going to do some stuff. Basically, if the action, so if action index, come on, action index equals free, so it's the logout, then we are going to currently just print it out. So logout. Otherwise, we want to switch the selected action index. So uh, selected action index equals the action index, just like that. Okay. And um, uh, also we want to slide the menu back. So, uh, and I suggest we should just do it before we do any action uh, uh, steps. So again, with animation, with animation, with a spring animation. And we are going to say show menu equals false. The same thing what we did when we tapped on the background. Okay, let's see it uh, right now. Let's see how uh, this looks like because you know, we are really, really close. We still need a little bit of, uh, you know, here is our menu currently. We have this divider and it's not doing anything because it's actually not sliding anything in, but you know, it's on top. We, we can already uh, see that this is put on the Z stack as the uh, frontmost element. Uh, 